adding text notes. I can add text to my detail. To do so, I'm going to go up to the Annotate tab. I'm going to go over to my text panel. I'm going to click on text. When I click on text, I get a format, uh, modify in format. The first thing we want to do is decide which style leader we want. We can have no leader at all. I could have one that has just a horizontal leader, you know, a one segment leader rather. It can be on an angle as well. I can have a two segment leader, which will have a leader and it'll have a shoulder. And so you will pick, in this case, we'll pick where the object is, then we'll pick where the shoulder begins, and then where the shoulder ends. Or we could have a curved leader. A curved leader has a bend to it, uh, more a little artistic. Then we have the format, where does the leader place? Uh, we'll have the leader at the top left when it points, when the arrow or leader points to the left. Uh, we can have it leader middle left, leader bottom left. Or if it points to the right, we can have leader to the top right, leader to the middle right, or leader to the bottom right. You'll notice that the, to the leader to the bottom right and to the leader to the top left are selected by default. These are the drafting standards in industry. So we'll leave those. And then we also have a line left. All the text gets lined up from the left and types to the right. Or we can have it centered up where it goes evenly between left and right. Or we could have it aligned with the right. I'm going to place a two segment and I'm going to have uh, the default alignment and I'm going to have the line left. I'm going to come down here and pick on my brick cladding. I'll pick again. I'll pick the length of my shoulder. I'll type in four inch brick cladding and then I just have to click outside of the text box and it becomes uh, a text object. I'll hit escape and there we go. We actually have uh, some text placed in there and in this case I have a leader line. Um, and once again I could actually go up here again and I'll say I'm going to do the same thing with the same align left and I'm going to come down here and pick and I'll place and I'll place and I'll say uh, you know decorative I'll hit enter and I'll go down to the next line uh, say the light panel and I'll click outside of it. When I'm done putting in text, I can hit escape twice. And now I got uh, two types of text in my drawing at this point. All right, so adding text notes is we're going to go up to the annotate. We're going to go to text and we're going to choose our formatting, how we want to set up the text.